There's been a lot of interesting PI build progress lately. Recently, Sandy Monroe visited Aptera. Uh, there'll be a dedicated video on Sandy Monroe's or Monroe Live's channel at some point. I was thinking of this week, or possibly next, depending on when they get to edit that. Uh, one thing I did see that I don't see many people pointing out, but these are actually the front wheel covers. And I believe at some point in the past, these might be plastic or they might be fiberglass because they're obviously going to take a little more abuse than the rest of the car, I would think. Uh, this is the window that goes up and down in the front doors. And that's the static one, front windshield. And they really have a lot of the body done. It's really, really close to like this is for some reason I haven't seen this cover yet. Um, maybe that didn't arrive or I would think maybe this is probably going on last because there, there's a lot more work going on up here. But as far as this video, one of the things I could think that was interesting was there's a lot of these, looks like these, I think these are probably like, they need to do cutouts for these. If you see these, there's another area that showed it a little bit more. You kind of see these X's here. I think these need to be cut out for access for wires and ducting and whatnot. So I wonder if that's done as part of like the milling process at CPC or have to do that on their own. I This is kind of like a PI bill, so they're probably maybe figuring this stuff out so they can kind of have CPC trim it as exactly how they need it. And here's the cabling. This goes to the rear charge port here. And it looks like it's not hooked up. Maybe the batteries, maybe they're waiting for some things to put it in, but it seems like the battery based on past videos was essentially done. It's very beautiful to see this coming together and I'm really looking forward to Sandy Monroe's video. Uh, some other kind of sneak peeks we've had lately from Steve and Jason on Twitter is we have, so this is the front headlamp, the kind of center headlamp, and then those Those are kind of the side kind of daytime runners, I guess you could call them. So that's very exciting to see those finally come in and they look really sharp. There was also the, this is the rear side marker. So this kind of goes, here, so that's what these lights are here. And then they got the, the rear top light. That goes on the hatch. You got the wheels, they got the suspension set up on the front. I would think that they put the glass on one of the last things so they just have easy access to everything here. As far as Jason, we got the motor installed, we've seen that. He's kind of teased us with some Pretty sure these are renders just at this point, but other thing I noticed was this is the kind of roll bar that they have, and so that's kind of looks like it's welded together at this point. I don't know if it's in the car. It's hard to tell because it should be here. Maybe that's kind of where it fits on top. That's probably going to be inside the car and not shown on the top because this is where the solar mounts on the top. Pretty cool images. I'm pretty sure this is a render. I don't think this is a actual photo. It just looks a little too clear to be like a real photo, but it's at the same progress as it is now as far as the what they've had. So I'm, this is really, really close to being like a drivable PI2 essentially, like an ugly PI2. Still beautiful, very beautiful to kind of see it all together. Pretty sure this looks like a render as well, but it's at the same stage. So it's, I could see them having a drivable unit, maybe in a couple of weeks, you know, they're super, super close. 
Anyway, let me know your thoughts. See if there's anything else that you've seen that I missed. There's the rear camera. So pretty awesome to see this progress. Um, yeah, let me know what you think. See ya.